forgot to put another mag. So I really like this uh, this LWPC by Velocity Systems. Let me just take off this backpack so you guys can see what the back looks like. And I also have the Velocity Systems Swift Clip uh, placard here. It seats three 5.56 uh, magazines. And then moving up, you guys can see my handsome face here. I just have this uh, this little face covering. Here, this is what it looks like. And then of course I got the Walker Razor uh, ear protections here. So leave your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. If you feel like I look like an operator, I think I look like an operator. Now I gotta get the training. I got the gear that I need. I can utilize this gear to put it to use, put it to test and see how it runs. Um, I'm gonna do some more uh, weapon transitioning and mag switches or whatnot. So I hope you guys enjoyed that towards the end of the video. This is Terrible Shooter. Remember, terrible isn't permanent. Peace. So what I'm doing is um, I'm working on some mag switches, weapon transitioning, and just drawing from the holster, just basic uh, weapon manipulation. Also, when I'm drawing from the holster, I'm not just drawing from the holster. Um, I'm drawing from the holster and I'm finding my red dot. Um, I'm trying to acquire my red dot a lot faster. I've been practicing on and off uh, throughout the weeks and I'm getting a lot better at uh, drawing from concealment, drawing from outside the waistband, and finding my red dot and putting on target. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm actually save some of the targets that I use at the range and I'm just aiming at the center of the target trying to find my red dot. With the practice, I'm able to find my red dot a lot faster than before. <laughs> you know how sometimes you draw, for you guys that use a, a RDS, sometimes when you draw, your red dot will be either the top right corner, bottom left corner, bottom right corner, uh, top left corner, you have to you know, align your sights or, you know, just move the gun around to find your dot. Uh, that's what I struggled with in the beginning uh, when I first started shooting with the red dot sight. And uh, since I've been practicing at home, I've gotten a lot better at finding it a lot quicker. Um, sometimes, I want to say eight times out of 10, I'm on point with finding it. So with practice, I'll find it a lot faster. <clears throat> that time it was top left, this time it was bottom, spot on, spot on. Spot on. Spot on. Top. I really like.
like the T-Rex arms uh, outside the waistband holster. Level one retention. A little bit low, but red dot is still in the, the window of the red dot. Can't even see it. It was top top left. Spot on. Also working. I got dummy rounds in my AR, so I'm using dummy rounds. Spot on. Fucked up the reload. We got the wrap back. Bottom left. <clears throat> Bottom left. Bottom left. Bottom left. Spot on. Spot on. To the right, but it's still in the window. Bottom right. Spot on. Ooh, perfect, spot on. Spot on. Spot on. <laughs> <laughs> 